Guys, welcome to the channel. This is the second quarterfinal, Leary versus ACCM. This is starting. It's the best of five. And what civilizations we're going to see because this is absolutely amazing. I don't know, guys, but we are already, we are already there. Okay, well, I got a problem. I got a little problem. Let me go back because, yes, I got a crash. They are getting also sometimes some crash. I don't know, but they got the crash as well. And uh, hopefully I'm going to be inside. And uh, let me go one second. Yes. And I am inside. We are going to see the civilizations very soon. Go, 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 guys. Go, go, go. Okay, I am in. And this is going to be what? Well, Kel versus Mayans, the first civilization. Okay, we can see that this is went super fast because I just joined it a little bit slower. And blue in the north with Kells. ACCM, red, Mayans in the south. And this is going to be absolutely amazing. Definitely. Look at this. Nice forest at the back. Berries at the back, a stone at the back. Some hills. Some hills there. Look at the goal in front. Yes. That goal in front is dangerous for Leary. That he has another goal. Well, look at a terrible goal. And what is the third one? Well, if this is the third goal, Leary has an awful, a really awful map for goal. Oh well. Oh well. Okay. Let's see, guys. Let's see. Stone at the back and... Uh... Okay. Well, the wood is nice. But other than that... That goal is terrible. Paris is good because he's uh, at the back too. And red, ACCM with the Mayans has wood on the right side, a big forest. A really big forest. That goal in almost same spot, close to that hill advantage. But that hill, it's not a, a good position, but it still is flat. So it's not terrible. But with those, with those crazy hills, it can be really, really dangerous. Definitely will be dangerous. Let's see how they play because the aggressive... Uh, in these kind of maps is is really important. Uh oh, you know, taking the board. There you go. Okay. Well, let's take the civilizations. Probably we'll know those civilizations, but uh, always good to take a look about the civilizations. And the eagle is already going, man. He's already going. Okay. Okay. Well, let's see. It's not going to go. What overlay? I have to quit. Petting overlay. Yeah, because if not, people is yeah, people is gonna check too much. I think it's better to hide. So now, guys, you cannot trick anyone and go for crazy bettings. Okay, <clears throat> it's better the surprise and go for crazy bettings. Well, Leary doing the loom and. Uh, then after check the Mayans, it's good to go for for the Kells. Well, Kell civilization in late game, if he's going with, if he's going to to late game with wood raiders, this would be really dangerous for. But the Mayans, the Meso civilization, we have seen how they are in incredibly strong, really, really strong. The, the thing is, why the players are picking the civilizations, for example, in this order, because actually Kels is a good choice against the Mayans, but the later game, in the start, I'm not sure, really, I'm not really sure, but we will see. Barrack incoming, remember that the wood from uh, from uh, the Kels, 15% more, it's, it's, give a dif it's make a difference, and it's make that, oh well, that Lurin, that Lurin, man, that Lurin, ay ay ay. Well, we will see, because we are always talking in the late game, but... But, to be in that stage, we need a lot. We need a lot, really, really a lot. Everyone, welcome to the channel, Sonic. I see everyone, all the lover boys, trying to, to tell hello to everyone. Really complicated. We have a lot of people already in the morning. And remember, this is only the start. We are going to destroy today, Age of Empires, right? There you go. Now he's going with the militias. Now he's gonna make a house, another house probably there to block it. He's doing as well and will be will be defended in front. But the militia is already there. It's already there. While the Mayans, 
ACCM is trying to go up, but he's, yeah, well, a bit behind. A bit delayed, better say it, because he didn't have directly the food. Anyway, you can see how Leary is going with the militias. He will have the food to go up soon. Not gonna be a big problem for him. And, well, of course, thank you for the looties that are appear there in the chat, over the chat. The action is here in the middle, so no problem. Look at those two militias and the scout. Okay. Yeah, well, civilization is kills and Mayans, you can see. And one villager probably down. This is good to start here from Leary. That villager should be bye-bye. He's gonna kill it or not? Well, now he's gonna save it, man. Because he went away. I don't understand. He went away and now he lost the militia. Which, it makes no sense in my opinion. Because he could take that villager. Definitely. Is he gonna take it or not? Well, no. He's not taking anything. Now Leary is... On the way to Feudal Age, 11 minutes 54. In that case, he's not gonna go for a fast caster. He will go Archie Range and Blasmith, and he will have to wall here. Well, he's doing the goal forward. But, like I said, he will have to defend. How? Probably a tower. But ACCM, ACCM is coming damn aggressive. Damn aggressive, two villages forward, three militias, and this is going to work probably well, because Leary is not up yet. He has to be really careful, this is completely open. Ay ay ay, and all visible here. You can see how he's coming again. And this tournament is absolutely amazing. We were, we were afraid from the walls, but where are the walls? I don't see the walls, at least not for now. And not yesterday, that was six cities. Now he's there. The tower is there, the men at arms are already there, and now Leary is in troubles because he's not reacting fast and unpredictable. No, he's there with the villagers and he's gonna lose that chick. Probably, yes, that villager is going to. No, he's saving the villager, unbelievable. But now, like I said, look at the goal. He will have to go for that goal because the tower is there. So now, problems, problems from. Leary in the house. Yes, this is a pause. Interesting pause. Come on, don't make pause. Yesterday, no pause at all. Yes, you have to play, man. You have to play smooth. Don't make pauses. Okay, it's a little pause. I don't know. I don't know. Okay. Okie dokie, the bettings are there now that are over, like you said. Chat off, man. No, chat off is good there. I'm not gonna switch this because I can interact with you guys thanks to the chat here. It's not a restart. How is it gonna be a restart in 12 minutes? It's impossible to be a restart. So let's see what is going to be. Okay. Well, I have done some few changes, Mr. Kuban. Uh, comments like bracket, like a schedule, like KOTD, like mem. All those comments will be will answer via whisper mode. Why? To keep the chat clean completely. So if you want to know, guys, okay, okay. If you want to know all that information, just check the whisper. Because now you should check, you should get all the information via whisper. Tell me guys if it's working, okay? Yeah, I have been doing some stuff to try to improve the experience for for everyone in the house. And uh, well, this big pause, man. This is a big pause. Well, I will check if it's a pause or what. Oh well, Leary drop it, man. Leary drop it. Oh well, oh well. I will keep going because he dropped it. Now he will come back. Leary has dropped. One, two Archie ranges. And uh, let's see, guys. Let's see. He's doing the Archie range. Men at arm. Well, double archery range, 30 population for for both. Look at this the scout. 
and the mana tarm. Uh oh, and the stream ended, guys. Stay tuned and come back. Let's go. This is coming back for the restore. Hopefully, it's not gonna now crash. It's gonna be good. Yes, and now we are going to be inside. No, but it's crashing now. What is this, man? What is this? It's crashing for me too. That's crazy. Well, I'm gonna take it down. I, I'm gonna. I'm gonna get in. It's gonna be a second, and we are there. There you go, guys. There you go. Okay. Is getting in or not? Yeah, it is loading. Oh well, oh well. It's now crashing a lot. What is this, man? Well, a problem. Not joining now the the game. Unbelievable that this happened now in the tournament. Well, hopefully we're going to be able to to fix it. Yeah, it's inside. There you go, guys. There you go. Okie dokie. Well, we have missed a little a little bit because this is sadly not working so much. And now it's have to catch up. But, guys, ACCM with 34 villages. Leary 30. He has killed some units here, but he has done the damage. He's three villages behind. He's now doing another tower and probably he cannot see. Let's put the color again. Okay. Leary need to be with blue and ACCM with, with red. He has a tower here now. And this is problems, man. This is problems as well for, for Leary, man. Well, ACCM been playing so good lately. And Leary, a counter tower in his goal. Very, very good tower. And he need to do it because with this tower, he's taking both goal. But he will need to palisade. If he's gonna discover him, he could go with the villages, but he didn't. So now, you need to palisade super fast, and taking the goal is the way to go. ACCM will be anyway ahead. Now, you can see the tower. He's gonna wall it. Yes, he's doing. There you go. But here, in troubles, man. In troubles, Leary. Leary now is in troubles. He's doing a little palisade as well. And he has no more stone. While ACCM is gonna make a tower in that goal. He needs to send arches. Because if not, if, if not, Leary is also in troubles. What's going on in, in this tournament? A lot of people that you think, oh, well, 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 favorites with big problems. Now, Leary is is under the big pressure in this situation and if he's coming now ACCM and put the tower well where he's doing another tower is he doing at home yes he need to recover that goal for that he did the tower and he will kill he will kill that tower yes but he will be idle with the with the goal yeah not taking it anyway I think it is better to defend his own goal that denied his goal it is possible Leary is still not taking any stone. Not taking any stone. Well, well, well. 39 villages, 37. Military double the army from Leary. But in this situation, the economy, the economy advantage from ACCM gonna be huge. And it is huge already. Unbelievable first game, but ACCM has the advantage. And Leary will be in big problems. No, not will be. He's already in big problems, definitely. Okay. Look at those four villages on goal. That's really dangerous. That's really dangerous. Now he's taking down. He's taking down those eagles. Uh, not sure though. Yeah, he's taking down now. Whoa! One! And two, ha! <laughs> in the last archer, with the last archer. He really need to go with army. But the problem is, and it's a big problem, ACCM will be there to go up to Castle Age. And in Castle Age, in Castle Age, with the Eagle Warriors, he's gonna be really ahead. Leary doing the wheelbarrow, but he has no economy right now. In comparison with ACCM, he really has no economy. He has the same villages, yes. But now ACCM with 10 either villages, okay. He's now going back with those arches. He's coming with a lot of eagles. Let's see. Well, obsidian arch, obsidian arrows. It's gonna be a, a huge upgrade. But that's in late game, late 
Castle Age, also you need a castle as well. Is Leary mining a stone? He's not. But guys, ACCM is going up to Castle Age. He's going up to Castle Age. And you know what that means? Because I can't explain to you what that means. What that means is clear. Leary in troubles. In troubles in this first game. Okay. Well, ACCM is up. Up to Castle Age. Well, Leary is up to nothing. He has almost 500 foot, but he has no gold, no wood, no stone, no nothing. All his own food. And now, is he gonna go aggressive? Well, we will see if he's gonna go aggressive. This, he's doing a second tower, horse collar, and on the way to Castle Age. And really, ACCM is mining a stone, not gonna have a stone to make a castle, but guys, he's doing a third Obama. Yeah, the third barrack. Do you see? Oh well, oh well. Okay, let's see. Look at Leary. But look how he managed the economy, man. Look how he managed the... He's up to Castellage, man. How is possible that he managed the economy like this? And he's up to Castellage only 1 minute 20 seconds behind with 21 army and 1 villager more. But those eagles are coming. And now, Eagle Scouts are not so dangerous, but Eagle Warriors are gonna be dangerous. He's gonna make a stable. Yes, he's gonna make a stable, okay? Because you are not checking Alien 963. Because if you check properly and you see close to 65 and 105 population, you will see what player it is. Because you are not checking the overlay, the whole overlay. And it's here. It's here, the point of view of the player. You see, Leary. And now when I switch, I am on ACCM. Okay, there you go, Castle Age, Eagle Warriors, and Leary will do what? Well, men at arms, you say, I don't know if men at arms, but with so many archers and killing the archer ranges, that's gonna be important, but the Eagles are coming, the Eagles are going to come, and it's in, in time to make the damage, he should go really, really aggressive now, or he will be in problems, he will be countered by Leary's army? I don't think so. Those eagles are gonna be sick, really strong. The eagles are coming. He's gonna be with plus two, with the squires upgrade as well. He should, he should palisade here. Is he gonna palisade? He's gonna get raided. Now Leary need to go back. He has some men at arms, four. And now the wall is happening. He should make another house there and he's doing. The knights and the crossbow upgrade is going to happen with both Kinaro. This is really, really dangerous. Really, really dangerous position here for Leary but he's walling and with those archers with plus two and few knights incoming he should be fine just fine but villiers one villain behind military more from leary but now he's patrolling and he didn't make the damage he didn't make the damage yes he didn't now siege warsop and outpost but with those knights men at arms and the crossbow he should be fine probably the tower might do the damage bozo Bozo incoming, okay, and let's see the crossbows, he's gonna make the damage with those knights and the men at arms, oh well, oh well, he has a kill advantage, he shouldn't take the fight, people say that Leary Micro is really, really strong, let's see if he's gonna show this, if he has a huge and beautiful speed, he need to go mining stone, he's not mining stone, so he's with only one tone center, ACCM, only one TC as well, no, now he has a second tone center, so that can be really an advantage for his economy in, in the later game, now he's trying to take those eagles, but he's not taking. Oh well, oh well. Kelts knights are not really great. He's only plus one and no bloodlines. Without bloodlines, nothing to do. Now he's coming and trying to go and raid. But he's gonna make the house again. And he has to be careful. Has to be careful. He's going around. Ay, 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 ay. He's gonna block. He's gonna make a gate or something. Is he gonna make a house and a gate? House and a gate. He need it. Gate and house. Okay, now he's there with the knights. A lot of crossbows, but like you said in the chat, plus one, plus one knights. Not gonna be an oath. The gate is happening, but he's coming. He's coming and he's gonna make the house, as I said. Menstradamus is still working. The knights are coming. Knights are coming. And has to be careful. The Mangor is gonna do the job. He's gonna kill. He's gonna kill. He's gonna kill and gonna be inside. Ay, 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 ay. He's gonna take it down. He's not taking down because ACCM Titanic. And now he's losing the Mangonel. He lost the Mangonel, man. He lost the Mangonels against one man at arm. The Knights are there. The Crobos as well. Is he gonna be able to take all this? Because now ACCM is losing a lot. A lot. 
Okay, this is not a good micro, but the eagles maybe don't need to micro. Those knights are going to be down. Look at that sick micro by Larry with the arches killing absolutely everything. Everything! Well, the knights might not might not be good, but when you have a good micro like he has and he play relaxed, the scores say that he's ahead. Economy, he's not ahead. Of course he's not. He has two tone centers, so he really needs to be careful and leery going to mine a stone or you will be by and by. This is absolutely tricky. You can see one, two, three tone centers, guys. Three tone centers with the Mayans. Three tone centers and he's going again. He's going again and Leary is gonna wall. No, what is he doing? Leary, oh man, oh man, I think he's over top. Okay, he's walling. No, he's losing the billiard. The speed is not working 100%. Now, university, but it's still only one TC. 10 billiards more. This game gonna be for ACCM because now, Leary. La 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 Well, he's now in a terrible position. 17 villages behind. Definitely, even if you see the score is ahead from Leary, he's not ahead. He's clearly behind now. He's gonna lose those rams. Definitely he's gonna lose the rams. Okay. Or maybe not. He's there with the arches and the knight. Okay, he's not gonna lose. He has the army, but if he's not pushing, if he's not pushing, the advantage for ACCM will be huge. I think it's important already. It's really important already. He's doing another barrack, so he needs to push completely. What is he push? But guys, one, two, three towers. Siege Warsaw to defend. One, two, three tone centers. He just needs to make eagles, some pikes, and maybe some mangonel. And like this, he will have a huge advantage in the economy. But the problem is... Leary is trying to go aggressive and he's going aggressive. Why the score is say that he's so close? Well, because he is still with more unit kills and more military. But right now it's 21 villier behind. It's still not mining a stone. So really, I don't know. Well, they are picking many times kills, but it seems that kills are dying, man. They are dying kills. I don't see kills like any great, like super great civilization in in Arabia, I never like it, Kells, but yeah, they, are strong, they can be strong, people like to, to pick them, but I don't know. Of course, Meso Civilization still has the advantage during the castle, of course, if they can go for a late game, mm. but let's see, that, that heal for ACCM is definitely not great. Now, he's coming with three rams, one of those rams are almost bye-bye, but here with the knights and crossbows, and in this spot, he should go in, man, he should... And now, Leary, he's gonna wall, he's gonna be able to wall or not, because, ay ay ay, and ACCM has a stone to make a castle, delete the farms and make the castle there, because you have the goal here, or, or even here, you need to make a castle, or the push Leary can do can be huge, well, he's trying all in, but those Monks, knights, and crossbows. Now he's doing the damage. This is ACCM game. Definitely the first game, unbelievable. But this is happening again. ACCM is taking the game. And now Leary will be one zero behind. This is absolutely impossible that he's gonna come back from this. Well, if he does, I don't know what to say. But look at the population and the game being called. Leary losing as well. What? is going on in this tournament well ACCM playing so good in the tournament so far and now the first game clear win for ACCM clear win really well play okay achievements military 37 largest army 38 economy food wood crazy man crazy but ACCM with gold and stone that's it and look at the village difference guys one zero already for ACCM. One zero already. Unbelievable. Wow. This is, guys, the second game from this series. And it's between ACCM and Leary. What civilization we are going to see from this great matchup? Well, that's the most important. Let's go. There you go. We are inside fast and unpredictable. And we have Mahjars versus Hans. Well, let me put blue Leary and the red Mahjars. That's an amazing matchup. Hans, Hans, 
versus Machiars. Whoa, 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 whoa. Well, Leary, better kill in the start because if you go for a late game, impossible to take Machiars. So let's see how they are going to play. He should go aggressive. He better go aggressive. Otherwise, big problems. Do you always say it? Well, GG, because you are always thinking in the late game, which is normal. Even more if you are an arena player, that you are playing with the walls, Mr. Marv. But here, this is open map, this is Arabia, and he should go aggressive. But still, I agree, if you go for the late game, oh well, oh well. Big forest on the right side, goal and stone behind that forest. Then, goal, main goal at the back. Really far from the TC, but at least he's at the back. He can super easy wall map here, Leary, an amazing map to wall. Only this is open, wide open I would say, but here, easy wall. Amazing map from Leary, an amazing and sick map. While, if we check ACCM map, here's a nice, a okay wood, berries at the back. The boar also at the back. Another big forest, but in front, crazy and terrible hills. Perfect map for Leary to go aggressive and make the damage. Otherwise, otherwise, he can be in big problems in the late game. That, that's absolutely for sure. For sure. So let's see, guys, what is going to happen here. Now, Villiers, all right, gonna take it down. The boar, there you go. Boar under the TC. And why we say that Hans and Machiars are really, really dangerous matchup for Leary? Because this is the Hans civilization. We all know all this overview, probably. Remember that Hans are not that powerful here because they are not uh, Kavarches that cheap anymore. But then we will check. We will check. We will check the Machiar civilization as soon as this overview is bye bye. Okay, okay, is the Hans still there? Yes, it is. Well, let's see. Now he has four villages on wood. Leary, three villages, so he wants to go a scout. Or at least fast up, okay. Let's go back. And now, Machiars. Machiars incoming, look at the scout runs. Look how cheaper they are, the scout, light caps, EDC, EDC. It's very good, man. And now we're gonna take the boar. Yeah, second boar incoming. That he has the second boar or or not? Now he's going. Okay, a little bit, a little slower, but he has the deer, so he's fine. Totally fine, actually. Okay, he did the the mill way faster, taking the foot because he's gonna go. He's gonna go. Definitely deary. Gonna go for a fast twenty one, maybe even. 21, up, yeah, it's possible, and a scout, yes, yeah, he's focusing completely on his economy, he's completely focused on his economy, remember that Lear is still getting the Aztecs, Aztec civilization, so dangerous and probably advantage, because with, with Aztecs, with those civilizations, with Meso civilizations, you always get the advantage, okay, okay, well, for village on wood, and now, since I listen to some little noises, I'm gonna do something. I'm gonna close my, my windows completely, and, and that's it. Okay. Okay, Lear is gonna go 21 up, like I was suggesting. He's now pushing another deer, and Lear will go up. ACCM is doing the barrack already, and will go men at arms. Interesting. Not going a scout rush. It's gonna go men at arms. Okay. They don't feel comfortable to go with, with men at arms. I don't understand this. They have a, a insane scout with the forging. But of course, men at arms with plus one can be dangerous too. Now he's going to the lead. The lead, sorry, make a bit forward, a bit more forward. And Leary can see. Oh, well, he didn't explore properly there. But he will notice that this is really easy to wall if he is exploring properly which he didn't. Now, he's gonna go scout. So he's going to standard. Nothing, nothing special is doing with the Huns. Going to standard. Well, now, Leary will find out ACCM. Well, let's see, all visible. The goal is super close, but he's not finding yet. He can see those deers. So he can imagine that if the deers are there, he should be close. But now, he's going 
in the wrong direction. Oh well, oh well. Ba basically, that villager will be dead. As soon as he's doing the, the little palisade, he need to go back. No, well... Oh well, this is panic, man. He's been trying... Oh, an ACCM! Is let him alive! That's... That's... Unbelievable. Unbelievable, really. Yeah, you can see. Some little panic mode. And, again, forward, man. ACCM is coming forward. I love how he's playing. Playing so aggressive. Be, 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 be careful. Be careful. And Andy Delt, if you keep spamming that the suite is needed and you have said 100 times, you will see what you will need. And it's an ambulance to keep talking in the chat. Okay? Come on, man. Stop spamming the same stuff over and over. Aye, aye, aye. And now... You will see, little palisade. Okay. Well, the mana times are there and the tower is gonna be there. Well, I like how he's playing. I don't know if he's gonna get a win in this one too, but he's going aggressive, man. He's going aggressive and he's gonna be in. He's gonna be in, he's inside there. He's playing good, man. He's playing good while Leary playing a sloppy, gonna be with one billion behind. He's in big troubles already. And this is gonna be really, really bad for Leary. Unbelievable, unbelievable. But this can be, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, this can be a 2-0 here. Well, a 2-0 again. Against ACCM with this series, that can be huge. And now, well, let's see what he's gonna do. Little Palisade trying to cover that the scout is gonna be bye bye. He's losing a lot. And when I say a lot, it's a lot because he's losing one scout. Now he's mining a stone too. There's, there you go. Towering coming. What the hell? He's mining a stone going all in, man. All in. Go mine a stone as well. Now he's wanting everything. Look at this. Very, very good play here by, by ACCM. What is this, man? Who is Leary here? ACCM or Leary? Well, the tower is going to be up. But now with the tower up, he can really take those villains if, if he's going fast. Go, go, go. He needs to kill the villain. He's going to kill some villain. There you go. He's not. He's not. He's not killing anything. Now with the tower, he's taking more villains and the food. Well, he can't take it. He's going aggressive now with those three scouts. But really, Leary, 30 population, is still one villain more. Why that? Because he's multitasking now, being better. Being absolutely better. All right. Okay. Now, you can see the Lumbercam on the right side. Going to mine gold or what is he doing? Let's check. He's mining gold, no stone, which is interesting and dangerous. Scout incoming, but he has a spear already because he has the barrack at home. I like this, I like this, because the barrack at home, it provides you a good defense against the scout. If you go forward with the barrack, you can be in trouble. Now, Archie range, you say that he's fine, but yeah, he's fine, two villages more, but he need to be really, really careful and Leo need to win with this civilization, in my opinion, yeah. In earlier game, because in late game, Machiars are dangerous. And now, he's gonna make a tower. He's gonna make a tower with four villains and a spear. Because, like you say, he's fine, but he has no stone. So now he needs to send villages. But he's gonna wall himself. And walling himself, he's gonna be more than okay. And Leary not gonna be okay anymore. Now he's there with two villages. He's gonna kill it. Is he gonna kill it? He can't wall. He wall it! He damn wall it! Ay, 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 He did it, man. Now, one archer incoming. He's gonna kill the tower. Yes, he will. Well, send the archer, man. He's not sending the archers. Look at this. Why he keep the archer inside? I don't understand. I don't understand. But he's sending. He's not sending the archer, which is bad. He's really bad. And now, is he gonna lose those villiers or not? The tower there is dangerous. He's gonna lose a villier. No, he's repairing. He's gonna kill that one. He needs to be really careful. And is still not sending the archers. Trying to kill that one. He's gonna kill this villier. No, because he's going back. And the tower is going to be... Oh well, oh well. Killing the spear? No, no, no. He's not killing the spear. He's trying to kill the villager. But, but, but. He's killing the villager. Got it. That was his main purpose. And now the spear bye-bye. Now with those archers taking those villagers down. 38th population. And now it's working Really, really good for Leary. He's six billies ahead and killing everything in the forward. Whoa! Good play there. I still not mining a stone. Super fast. Now recover seven billies ahead. Seven billies ahead for Leary. That's a lot. But guys, 
ACCM resources. 500 foot, 340 gold. If Lear is not attacking fast, I want to see what he can what he can do. Well, yeah, his eight will is behind, but look his economy. Did you say GG too quick, guys? Too really, really quick. Yes. Yesterday, I was checking a little bit. I was checking a little bit the games, and you were telling GG many times, and then it was happening exactly the opposite. You say that Lee will catch up fast. We will see if he's gonna catch up fast because right now he has ten farmers. Well, ACCM has. 10 farmers as well, so he has the economy to go up fast and unpredictable. He's there with the arches, with 4 arches and fletching. He's losing one, not the best micro, he's wall completely, so with all those walls he should be fine, just fine. But still, Leary eats with 7 villages more. In my opinion, he should, he should go and kill this tower. Why? Because there's nothing to defend. But he's sending the scout. If he's now sending the scout, he can take all this. But now he's not microing properly. He's losing the arches. Go with the scout. Oh my god, open formation. He's not going. He's not going now. He's not going with the scout. He should have gone and will kill the skirmishes. Now with the arches, we'll take the, the spear back. But... But, 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 no, 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 he's not going, he's not going, resources is still okay, he's not going up anymore, he's doing more army, he knows that he needs to make more army, or he will be in problems, ACCM will borrow, there you go, 8 billion more. Yeah, he's gonna kill the tower, gonna destroy the tower more than kill, and now, 2, 4, 6, 7 archers is going to go aggressive, gonna go right around, mm, he will try, he will try, he's not doing for now. 5 scout taking down the tower, 58 population, 59, 45, the difference is huge, at least in population, resources, is getting closer, is not that, that uh, much anymore, and really, with those scouts and the skirmishes, Leary should take this fight, for sure, is he gonna take it? Go, 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 just leave the villages and go with the army, exactly what he did. Going back, and with the scout and archers, guys, check below the stream. All the information is in the stream, and you keep talking about the times. Unbelievable, guys. Ay, ay, ay. Okay, four scout archers incoming, will borrow with Leary. For Leary, sorry, and resources almost the same. Okay. Yeah, he's 10 villages, 11 villages different. What the hell economy difference he has. Yeah, man, it's huge. It's really huge. But the timing that they will go to, to castle, it seems to be really similar. You can you can see four spears, a lot of skirmishes. Not going to be able to do the damage. I think it will be difficult. But we'll go up to castle H right away. Okay, that's that can be huge. Really huge. With 10 villages more. Imayan, man. Imayan. Oh, Scout, archers, will borrow. Look at the scouts going. Uh oh, he needs to be careful, but he's gonna kill all the spears. He's gonna he's gonna kill all the spears. Leary is on the way to Castle H, but ACCM is going up too. But with eight villages different, just make your maths and imagine how many resources he's gathering with eight villages more, ten army more, and now. With bloodlines incoming, gold mining doing all the average because he has a really stronger advantage. Really better economy, for sure. Uh oh, uh oh, okay, he need to go back. Remember that now he will have the plus two. ACCM now doing the horse collar. He still need to raid, but he's not. He's not raiding. Why he's not going to the wood, trying to raid? Well, he's waiting to castle H. And then, with the botkin and the crossbows, he will try to make the damage. And here, well, he didn't finish anything. You can see in the minimap the red color, but there is nothing for him. Now he's taking with those scouts, bloodlines, and those archers. He might take most of the military. He's trying at least. He's now going to kill the spears. He's killing or not? No, he can't. Because he's moving so much. And he has to be careful. He's losing army now. Okay. Difference in the military is getting closer and closer. Like you can see. Because those skirmishes are working so good. Even with heal disadvantage here. Yeah, he's trying to kill the spear, but he can't. Why? Because no ballistic in Feudal Age. And those 
archers are not working great. Now he's gonna lose the scout and he's gonna lose another scout. No, he killed one spear finally, trying to micro properly, but it's still definitely a better fight for Leary. For sorry, for ACCM. Military ACCM now. More army, man. Unbelievable. Really unbelievable. But he's gonna go with Hans four archie ranges and university economy. Well, crossbow, botkin arrow, and the economy from uh, from ACCM is the difference here. Huge difference with the economy. But guys, he's mining a stone. Don't be so surprised that he will make a castle here. Look at the stone. And Castle in this spot to cover the goal seems he's in troubles. Now he's gonna lose those archers. And Leary will go with a lot of camp archers. All right. Okay, not doing crossbow upgrade. I think it's not worth it. He has four or five crossbows. Tenville is different. And ACCM is still with more army. Now ACCM gathering more and more stone. And coming with the cap archers. Will be difficult for him. Even more now that the ballistic it's happening. Well, four archery ranges is the standard with the hands. It's the standard. That he has the bloodlines. He does. Because he did, you see, in the transition to Castle Age. Thumbrin even. Whoa. Whoa. Well, ACCM need a castle or will get wrecked. With that army, those cab archers are gonna be really strong and husbandry as well. Don't be so surprised that he will make also the plus two. If he's doing the plus two, well, well, well. <clears throat> I really think that he should get this game, but but the execution is gonna be crucial. He has a tower here, remember. And now Lear has a, a second tone center. Yes, he does. So even better advantage in the economy. And gonna take some billies, I believe. One billion down. Two billies down, three billies down, probably, oh well, now he need to go back, those archers are working good, but he's coming with crazy amount of crossbows, TC here, well, he's not doing the, he's not doing the, uh, the castle, which surprised me, to be honest, but now, the advantage is just huge, 14, 15 billies difference, but ACCM is a fighter, I don't think so, he's gonna give up soon, because he's, I have seen him, <coughs> sorry, Fighting in way worse circumstances. Really? Of course, man. I mean, hands are good, man. Hands are good. Well, except a really bad play here. It should be important. Advantage here. He's gonna try to get the heal advantage. And now with those Cav Archers, he should, should kill everything. He should kill all these units. And he's taking all the units. Oh well, oh well. Hands are hands. And now, don't be so surprised. Look at the difference. He called the GG, man. He called the GG. Wow. Like you said, hands and hands. The execution in this game was Leary. The, the real one. And he took the game. Definitely. Well, he did an amazing job in this one. One, one, guys. And uh, he used the hands perfectly fine he did an amazing defense to to the forward and then he got a huge advantage with the economy definitely man achievements military nine billions more 26 largest army 21 and it's nice because for those statistics those people that love to talk about civilization my chat well hans dominated the machiars and people was telling in the start of the matchup ay 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 machiars gg to zero well look at the food Look at the wood and look at the goal. With those resources, with any civilization, you will get the advantage. <laughs> Let's go back. Guys, the cities are 1 1, even Zidius. And now, we're going to see ACCM versus Leary with Malai versus Burmese because ACCM call a restart. So, after the restart, we probably will see the game running smooth. Hopefully, and no more restart. I want to see the action. There you go. Okie dokie guys, okie dokie, there you go, oh, Captain Villager, thank you for the resubscription, guys, I don't have the alert activated, you know, I mean, only, only there, because I want to focus, I'm sorry, I want to focus completely in the action, let me, let me change the color, Leary is blue, and ACCM red, I will remove here the bettings, and I will show you when the bettings are finished, and you cannot play with the percentage. Like we said before, Leary with Burmese, you can see the relics location, so usually when the relics are in that position, he's not gonna be here, he should be between that. Because here it's not possible also, or here is it's really short. Usually the location is, the relics can tell you where is gonna be your opponent. <coughs> 
I'm sorry, I'm a bit, I am a bit cold today. So hopefully, okay. Let's see. Well, the lutis, the lutis don't cover the action, Mr. 360 Blunt. But uh, the alerts with the sound don't let me cast in because they are talk, they are, they are loud. They interrupt me. But the lutis is support and it's covering the chat. So it's not covering anything. Now a stone at the back. Berries. Nice wood on the right side and at the back. Gold in top of that hill. I will show you everything. The stone is important. Really forward. But this one at the back is crucial with this civilization. A really easy map to wall on the left. So his map is decent in that part. But the goal is crucial and is bad. Really bad goal for Leary. For sure. Now ACCM. Well. His three, four village on wood. And uh, goal on a site. Don't like so much. But it's better than the Aliri, that's for sure. Berries in front. Stone also in front a little on a, on a site. These oases are awful. Really, really awful. Oh, and Leary gonna lame. Leary gonna lame. I believe so. Oh! He's not letting. Look, look, look. Look at the boar. He's dancing. The boar is dancing. What the hell? Okay, he's gonna he's gonna block or not? Leary. What? What? Good blocking there. What the hell? Okay. Well, he's not laming the boar. He's not laming. Why? I don't know. But then, then guys, why he's there? I mean, why he's there? He's trying to lame, maybe, or, or not gonna lame. Well, 14, 15 population. He's trying at least, but isn't better that, that he's laming the boar? As to micro, I'm, I'm focused here. I will I will focus in others too very soon, but well, he's the, yeah, he's denying him. Now he's here with the scout, but his scout is Low HP, he was trying to get the boar and he couldn't either. You see, 72 HP. Well, he hit before he's hitting and here is still... Oh, well. Oh, well. Oh, oh, oh. Billy down. No! Stop it. That, that is stop it, but there's no loom. So, Billy is going to be down. Definitely down. There you go. There you go. Billy down. He's doing the job. He's doing the job. MBL. Oh, 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 my God. The Luring. Amazing Luring. Amazing and sick Luring. He's gonna lose a guy. And no, and the board stop. What? What the board? What the hell that board? The board stop. He's drunk board, man. Why the board stop it? What? The board stop it, man. The, no palisade. I didn't see any palisade, man. I didn't see him. No, no, no. I, I mean, he didn't make any palisade. No, I didn't. I, I didn't see it. I, I, I wasn't in his point of view, but but maybe he did. Well, you cannot see his palisade if you are not in his point of view. Hmm. The CCM no, it's not super fast, man. <sighs> no, no, it, it was it was fake. I, I like it more that it was fake. I don't like the palisade trick because then it's, it's nice. I, I prefer that the board was drunk. <laughs> okay, it's true that I wasn't in a CCM point of view, so he probably did the palisade anyway. It's a good save and a lucky save, but he lost already the scout and one villager. Scout and one villager, so he's not gathering information anymore and he has one villager less. But if there is a drop, if this is another pause, it's because he's gonna drop again? Leary? Come on, man. Stop dropping, man. Okay, well, let's see. No, he's going. Nice. The game keep going. It's a little pause. In tournaments, you have noticed that people almost don't pause. It's normal, man. It's, 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 it's really important games and you don't want to pause, at least not a lot. But let's see, guys. The thing is, Usually this shouldn't be a terrible a terrible stew for for ACCM because he's with Malai and Malai give you the advantage with uh, going up 80 80 percent faster you will have more villages and you can go up almost at the same time or even faster than your opponent it's now pushing the deers okay and ACCM you can see the same seconds same seconds basically two seconds difference 
and is still one village ahead when he lost one. So basically, this civilization provides you two village advantage. His wood is awful. Look at the land break him. It's fine because, but he's gonna cut soon and gonna be on the oasis. Okay, taking the deer. And uh, what is Leary doing? Leary has the barrack in front of the town center. It was Leary who paused it, not Vietnam, like you can see. And he's doing men at arms. Yes. Well, not a surprise. Remember that they will be with plus one extra. Two villages on goal, going with the militias. Okay, three militias, no retroshift. I'm, I'm not doing that because if not, I cannot interact with the viewers. And something really important is interact with the viewers. Why do you care about this? It don't make any sound. Why you why do you check there? You don't have to check that. You have to check the action. Use focus, concentrate, and you will be fine. Three men at arms, scout. Okay, because I don't like the grid mod. For that, I'm, I'm not using. You see, I cannot a answer to those questions. And I focus in the game and also in my viewers. Oh, 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 that's not a good micro. Well, he didn't got so much damage. Okay. Oh, oh, big. Oh, well. Oh, well. And now is he gonna take down? No, no, no. No, no, no. Okay, he's trying to make all the damage. He's trying to make all the damage there, but he has also the villages. Let's go and switch now for ACCM point of view. And there you go. Well, he's already getting some idle time. Like you can see, look at those men at arms. And, okay. Oh man, go, go back. There you go. Nah, he lost it. He's fine. I mean, even if he has the plus one, you see how it's not that important, the plus one? I mean, it, it can be, but that is not. It's not crucial. Now he's coming with archers and skirmish. He has one archer range. He has one archer range too. Doing the fletching already. Ooh, he has double it axe. Just look. He has... Double it axe, he's not going forward, he's coming with army. And he and Leary has double it axe for free. So look at the, the difference that in the economy that he's gathering already. Now, guys, Leary seven army! Seven army well ACCM one. Basically nothing. He need to make the tower because he's gonna be in trouble, really. And he's lucky that those are only two arches because the skirmishers are not doing so much damage. He's gonna have the tower already. There you go. Wow, he was really taking the the advantage. Two villi one, two villies difference. Mm, way more army right now for Leary. He's playing now strong, stronger than the first game for sure. It's like the first game uh, Leary is getting troubles all the all the cities. Yep. Okay, skirmishes, archers, forty population, thirty four. His wall completely now. Is this wall, or I think it's wall, right? Yeah. Okay. Go oh, archers, go skirmishers. Archers, skirmishers. Yes, one draws or, or make the loot is when the when I am offline, right? Make the loot is when I am offline and it's not supporting. Do that, guys. Unbelievable, guys. You are guys are unbelievable. Anyway, one archie range, blasmith. Oh, oh, is he gonna do it? Is he gonna do it? Okay, Leary Tone Watch, and now one Archie Range Blasmith. Well, the advantage is, is, is super important, really important here because he has 
A lot more army, man. A lot more army. Wow. Skirmishes, archers. Look, padded archer armor. Yes. Okay. Oh, he's doing the plus one armor. And now, let's see. Let's see. ACCM doing the wood barrel, but now he's gonna trap him. He's gonna trap him. He's recovering with this fight. He's recovering. Okay. He's recovering. Okay. Now look at those skirmishes. And ACCM with the wood barrel. Yeah, he's taking now, man. He's, he's doing a good fight there. He's doing a good, fa a good fight there. Okay, look at those arches, skirmishers. And now he's taking or not? Okay, he's going he's going around with those archers, skirmishers, pilot archer armor. Now he has the advantage there. Five villies, five villies difference. Five villies difference. Oh man, look at this fight here. Now trying to get the hill advantage with nine population difference. Eleven population difference. Okay. No oh, man, it's a lot of army. It's a lot of army there. This is a good fight, a really good fight from Leary. A really good fight from Leary. Okay. Okay, 64 population, 49, 15 population difference. Oh well, oh well, this is a terrible wood. I told you guys that when they could a little when they could a little bit, when they could a little bit is so so dangerous. And he has to move. His map is awful, sadly, but he has a really bad map. He needs to mine a stone. He needs to mine a stone and make towers. Otherwise, ACCM is in big, no, in huge problems. In really huge problems, okay. Okay. Okay, skirmishes will borrow. It's really complicated game. Yeah, but the resources. Well, you have to be careful because look at the resources. An ACCM with Malai will be faster up. Will be faster up. Okay. Ooh, ooh. Okay, well, you can see. One, two, three. Yeah, a lot of villains doing the tower. Wow, but he's countering here. It's, it's a good counter. Look at the arches and now the skirmishes. You say that it's over, but I don't think it's over. 16 population difference is, is crazy, man. Okay, he's going back. He's going back. And, and now what? Wow, that's crazy. That's really, really crazy. Well, you can see, guys, one minute ahead. One minute ahead. You say this over already, and now ACCN four villages more. It's true that Lee has a lot of army, but this is this is bad here. This is bad here. Let's see. Is he doing here a tower? Whoa, he's not using the stone. He's not doing a tower and he's not mining a stone either. Leary is skill bar in armor. What a game here with arches and skirmishes, okay? Yeah, the map here is it's terrible. Uh, well, yeah, it's, they have both bad maps. You can look at this here. Oh, and now killing more villages. This is awful map for both in the wood. Look at the tower he's doing. He can still put the arches or skirmishes in that spot and will reach those that wood. 
And with the skirmishes and archers, okay. He's not going out of ice. He has no gold ammos. And now look at ACC and resources. Crossbow, Botkin Arrow. He has not a lot of army. That's the good thing for O'Leary. O'Leary has better resources, definitely. But he's three villages behind. Now doing one, two stables. Okay. Leary Botkin Arrow. Well, let's see what he's gonna be able to do. He doesn't have Elite Skirmishes. I think he should make the Elite Skirmishes for sure. He has a lot of army. But still, this Malai is dangerous, man. You can see. Uh oh, not Elite Skirmishes. And he's coming with good amount of army. He needs Elite Skirmishes. But now, but now, ay, 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 ay. He's moving, he's moving, he's moving. No, don't move. He's moving. And now he's gonna get. With that army, Billy and down or not? Okay, he's not killing. Ay, ay, ay. He's coming with the knights. Elite skirmishes. Whoa, he lost a good opportunity here, ACCN, to make the damage. But now he's gonna be fine. Leary will dominate with the knights, with those skirmishes. He's gonna take it down. He's really gonna take it down. Ay, ay, ay. Okay. Okay, going with the knights. Look at those elite skirmishers. Okay. Now I'm extra down centered, Leary. One TC extra. ACC, not extra TC. Now he's doing a TC out of the map. Do you think that TC is good? Come on, man. That tone center is not even taking the wood properly. I don't like that TC, but where to make it, right? Yeah, he's completely corner. This is like a Bua TC. But, uh, well, his two villages really still difference in favor to him, which is crazy. But, uh, I don't know, man. Yeah, that TC is awful. He's coming with the Mangonel. If he's doing a good Mangonel shot, then maybe he can do something. But gonna be really, really difficult. Yeah, I really believe. Really believe that the amount of army Lear he has is huge. And he's getting so good in this game for him. But if he's doing a good Mangonel shot and he's trying to do it. Okay. He has the same amount of villains. He's coming now with the Mangonel. He's gonna go with the Mangonel. Ay, ay, ay. Let's see. Let's see if he's gonna do the job with that Mangonel shot. Mangonel and crossbows. Mangonel and crossbows. Oh, Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! There you go! There you go! Nah, he's reading here, also on the right side. He's reading complete 20 population difference. He's now getting huge advantage. But guys, how is it possible he's still with the same amount of villages? He's crazy, really. He's crazy. But still, there's a lot of idle time. Like 20 idle villages that count like no villages working. And 24 army, 8 army. He's now trying to raid. He should go and, uh, and take down that tower, to be honest. But he's coming with two mangonels. And look at the wood here. Oh my god. Why well, he's not moving a little bit? Try to expand your economy, because like this, what is this, man? This is, yeah, move your echo. Yeah, Leary is putting all the pressure completely. He is still corner completely ACCM, and this is looking so damn good from Leary. It should be the game, definitely. Oh, well, he killed two mangonels. Now he's doing another TC. Finally. Okay. And those really is going to be bye-bye. Well, the score difference is... It's not increasing, just the opposite. Okay, 20 population. 20 population. To Mangonel, Skirmishers! Oh, with the Mangonel is coming, and now he's gonna take it. He needs to open formation! Gonna lose a lot of crossbows. Well, he did okay. 
he lose some, but he also kill a Magnolia, which is great. And here he keep raiding three villages different. He's going with the crossbows, but he's he's not expanding at all. He did another TC, but in the same dangerous spot. It would be better, but he didn't explore, right? Well, he did somehow, but not completely. So he cannot see that this flat and is good to make a, a good tone center. Now he's still going, man, and uh, still unbelievable that he is still with that amount of villages. Yeah, but he's pushing completely. Leary is not taking any risk in this game. He's pushing and GG call. GG call. Leary, clear win. He controlled the game completely and I see that he's playing really strong. You can see how Leary, after losing the first game, has been calmed down, going strong, no atom bias, not even almost a stone. Just push him, man. With a crossbow rush, skirmishers, and then added Knights with Blindlands plus one and dominated the map. The map from, from ACCM was pretty bad, to be honest. Pretty, pretty bad. So guys, 2-1, two, 2-1, one, two, one, going for the fourth game. This is starting already and there you go. All right, guys, this is... Ooh, oh, GG Cole, man. GG Cole. Mongol versus Aztecs. Mongol. Mongol versus Aztecs. Are you kidding me, man? Are you kidding me, man? Wow. Well, you have now Leary. Well, when I saw the Mongols, it's dangerous. But it's all about the execution, guys. It's all about the execution because he might if now he's coming with 18, 19 population and going super forward and super and super fast. Well, Aztecs who dominate in this matchup, but the Mongols, if he's going aggressive or tower rush, something crazy like this, is the chance for him to go and, and take it. Let's see if this is going to happen, okay? But, uh, well, go at the back. This is Desert Like Arabia again. Remember, this is a special terrain done by a Brazilian guy that I'm sorry, but I always forget the name. That's crazy. And big forest at the back. Berries. Not really far from the TC. Okay. Yeah. What is this? A subscription? There you go. Thank you so much, man. Thank you so much for the resubscription. Okay. I will keep it hidden. At the board. Well, let's see, he's trying to lame. For that reason, he's sending the eagle super early that he has explored almost everything. Well, he has one, two boards. Yeah, he's fine because he can see both boards. So he's trying to go for the laming. He's taking already one ship. And now, well, we will see. We will see. Stone, one, two, three, deers. Look at the berries at the back. Three villages on wood. Lot of, well, it's a nice forest, but the goal is for, this goal is fine. And he can palisade. Well, he has a decent map. I mean, if he palisade this one, you know, with gold at the back, birds at the back, he can put in front. And this is, oh, this is completely walled. Okay, I think I like his map. It's easy to defend, to be honest. Really easy to defend. Yeah, he's now doing the loom because the eagle is dangerous. He's going to take down another two ships. Oh, well, oh, well. I'm going to, to check ACCM, ACCM point of view, and... Okay. Okay, well, I'm sorry, but I wanted to find you. Yeah, because... There you go. No, it's not trap. It's open. It's open. No, it's not. It's not back. It's not back. Yeah, four villages on wood. Look at that. Those little palisade. And he didn't explore those those ships. Yes, yeah, it's, it's horrible, but but it's not trap. But still, guys, since he has the deers not really far, and he's Mongols, he should be completely fine. He also did... Oh, what? 
Leary, what are you doing? Well, I don't know what he was trying to do. But he was trying to come forward to land the stone, both the stone, and he lost the villager. Good job, Leary, going forward without the loom, doing the loom later, and he lost the villager. Crazy. Well, ay 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 ay. Okay, one, two, three houses. Look at the goal in front, goal at the back, and uh, well, he's gonna. He's palisading, he's, he's walling them up. And now he's slamming the boar! Whoa! And, and took two ships. Well, this is the kind of things that can make that Leary lose the game. Leary, instead of focusing his game, he was trying to lame. He has lost a village. Now he lost two ships and losing the boar. Losing the boar. So ACCM is now in a good position. He might live with the Mongols. He's gonna take the boar back. Okay, let's see. Because he's gonna be really, really strong. Oh well, oh well. Now the eagle is trying to block it. He's gonna be able to block it or not? Because I think he's not gonna be able. Well, he's there. He can block it. He's doing some little palisade. But the boar is going to stop. Well, he's trying at the maximum. But now send the villager. He's gonna go up. He doesn't have the food. Unbelievable. But he doesn't have the food and he's doing more villages. This darkies is pure titanic. Titanic, right? Well, the boar is going to go between those houses. Ha <laughs> ha! He's taking the boar in the last second. All right. He's taking the boar. Not the best luring, but he took it. And now he's going to go up. What? Look at this. Uh, look at this. 499. Amazing. I love when that happens. Yeah. He's up to feudal age with 24 population, 11 minutes, 30 seconds. While Leary, Leary is not even up because now he has no boar, no ship. No ships, no nothing, nothing. This is absolutely awful dark age for both players. But I will say that it's even a worse for, for Leary because he lost the, the villager, he let him get lame it. And well, when you get lame it, when you try to lame and you get lame it, ay ay ay. Mongols with extra boar. Yeah, but Mongols has been, the, has been delayed. It's not that important anymore. He should go for for what? For a scout. He lost the eagle. He's gonna go a scout, I, I believe. He has a lot of food, like you can see. And he's not doing anything. He's not walling. Whoa, the game is going not a standard. A lot of scouts are leaving. Could be in problems, really. But the problem is, guys, the problem is they don't know about this, about this situation, you know? They cannot see it, man. They cannot see everything that, that we do. And now, stable, stone. Okay, stone. He's gonna make towers, stone wall. I don't know, but he's mining a stone. He's doing the double with axe. I think he didn't. Did he, did he make it, the double with axe? He's doing now, all right. Uh-oh, one villager down. One villager down. No, 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 no. I think he's gonna save the villager. He saved it. Now he's going back. One HP. Didn't have full, full HP scout. And now he's going with the scouts. Remember, this is a new architecture for the mo well, a new. It's already old, right? But it's a special architecture for the Mongols on the Wallolo Kingdoms. Well, the Dark Age has been titanic, but now Leary has the resources to go up to Castle Age, man. Yeah, look at his resources. Blasmith, and with that farms and so on. Uh, this is wall completely. His wall completely as well. He can go Castellage, man. He can really go Castellage. Okay. Well, let's see. <laughs> Just confused, right? You confused what? This is a stable and this is the barrack because you don't see it. this is is clear the, the look at the horses man why you're so confused it's, it's obvious that the stable is not it's not there yeah it's different but uh, now nah, he's he's going up if he, if he, he can go up market yeah man he's going up and look at the time so he balanced the economy and guys he's about to go up to castle age there you go man leary it's on the way to Castellage with two barracks. This is looking so damn good. 
while ACCM need to wall Stonewall and pray. He has to pray. Is true? Oh well, that tower taking both the stone and and now what? Try to go inside. This would be Larry game a hundred percent. I believe so, man. He has a huge advantage. Leary double with axe. Halfway to Castellage. Halfway to Castellage. And now, well, uh, let's see, man. He's doing the market, and we'll try to go up. But he need he needs some some walls, some towers, some something, you know. He needs something. Okay, three scouts. Leo is almost there, but uh, he needs more resources. Look, his resources still 200 foot away from this, and doesn't have the huge amount of farms to gather the food super fast. He's not stone walling, but he will. He will have to. That's a lot of stone, actually. Yeah, is Leary going to go forward with a Belier? Yes, he's gonna push, man. He's gonna go siege, man. He's gonna go siege. Remember that the winner of this match is waiting. It's waiting who? Yeah, we'll be waiting. Doubt or heart? Doubt or heart? He's gonna go with the Belier. And gonna do what, Leary? Oh, that's not his villain, man. He says CCM, yeah, it's true. He's not going forward. What the hell? I'm crazy. What is that? Well, is that really a coin? I thought it was Leary. Yeah, it was the tower. Was confused for a second. But ACCM is on the way to Castle, so he's not going aggressive, but now he's going. I was sure that he was going to go, you know? Yeah, look at the villain going with the Eagle Eagle Warrior. Now he's sending. Yeah, it's normal to go siege. I was suspecting that. I was reading the future, man, man, Stradamus, it wasn't a mistake, it was on purpose, come on, guys. <laughs> but now he's going, he, but he can see it, and ACCM will be in Castellage, but guys, ACCM, don't be so surprised, look at his stone, he will make a castle, man. He will do a castle. <clears throat> well, I believe so, that he will do a castle, yes, yes, Mr. Fur, he will make a castle, all right. Yes, today he's playing all the games, all the games remaining from this round. Hoy se van a jugar todas las partidas restantes. Está el calendario debajo del canal. I just say it in Spanish because I see that some people is asking in Spanish. So I just answer them because they don't know. I don't know how they don't know because I think he's not advertising in the, in the in my in my newspaper at home. Okay, let's see now. He's gonna make the castle. There you go. Gonna make the castle here? I think so. But he need to make it now. If he's not doing, if he's coming with a siege, fast enough. Let's see. He's gonna make it with the village here. There you go. Yeah, he's not taking a huge risk, but still. Castle incoming. Coming with the migrant. Leary can see the castle. He's coming and trying to get in. If he's getting inside. This is going to be dangerous, no, gonna be painful. He's gonna be inside. Well, I don't know if he's gonna be able to make the castle. Oh my goodness, he needs to go and make the castle fast and unpredictable. This is open, this is open and he's not doing any other walls. Ay, 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 come on ACCM, you cannot lose the game like this, unbelievable. Well, the, the mangler is going, he's trying, but he's not doing it. And the castle is going to be up. Beautiful castle, at least we can make the castle. ACCM is fine. You say that he's fine with 32 villages, literally 43, no army and a lot of other villages. Well, if he's fine, I want to see when he's gonna be in a bad position. All right. Okay, now he's doing Mago Dice. The Mago Dice can raid, I believe so. But man, one, two tone center. All right. And Siege Workshop. Of course, he's gonna wall. He's doing the Siege Workshop with those Mago Dice, he can do something. But this is open, guys. He did a stone wall, but this is still open. You see? Look, still one tile. Still one tile. Ay, ay, ay. Okay. He has no fletching. Now he's doing the fletching. That's one knight. I don't know why he did the knight, but he did it. It would be better to, to, to make the, the bloodlines for the Mago dice. 
Okay, he's trying. Well, he has the castle, so he should be okay for now. But there's a hole, so if he's getting inside, still big problems. Big, big problems. Now 43 population, 66, 22 population difference. And Leary, no, he's, he's pushing now. He's pushing, but uh, we'll have a, a good economy soon. I don't know if he's gonna make, yes, he's doing another TC, three tone centers, why not? Why to keep going only with two tone centers? It makes no sense. Smile one so he will try to go and raid. Yes, he will try to raid. This is the chance he has. It's really difficult position here for ACCM. And if you see the score is ahead, which is unbelievable. Probably it's ahead because he explored a lot. You see, look at the exploration. He has explored all the map, but here is open and he don't see it. He don't see it and, 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 and I'm telling you guys, he's open, but he's not walling. Unbelievable. What the hell is going on ACCM? You wall a stone wall all the map, make a castle and you let him go in? Make a wall! It's only one tile, man! Only one tile, but he's not walling! Unbelievable! All the eagles! Look, 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 look! What the hell is this? Well, this is really, really, really bad! Really bad for him! Now he's trying to go with those mines that is not doing anything! And now he's getting raided! Well, free raiding, those billies are blocked himself! And the Leary has the game! Has the game. And if you see that the advantage is there, no, it's 14 billions different. He didn't wall so much idle time. Killing the market. He has few Magundais there that the Magundais are not gonna dominate. He's gonna kill the market. There you go. Those villains is still idle. Oh, he's inside, man. Be careful, man. Be careful. Ay, 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 Leary. He didn't see that he's inside and now killing a lot of villains, man. Well, with both Kinaro killing a lot of villains, ACCM is there because he break in and he's ready, man. He's ready. He's not over. He's still playing. Look at this. Look at this. There you go. Now, with those Magonites plus two, he can raid a lot. He has nothing at home now to defend and he's ready. Imagine if he was holding him. Here, but now he's converting the Mago dice. He convert one Mago dice, doing more Mago dice. But now, how to hold against that? Anyway, action all over the map. Leary redemption, redemption. He need the redemption because he dares with the Mago. Another castle. Whoa! This is the way do you have to defend with another castle, but he's coming with the mangonel. Ay, 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 killing billions. He's gonna now to convert the mangonel. He needs to send all the billions. Only chance for him to do something. He need to finish, but he can convert the mangonel. Ooh, he converted. He converted, but he's now killing because of the other castle. Send all the damn villagers. If you want to make something in the game, you need to make this castle. Is he going to be able to do the castle? This is so, so intense. Because now, if ACCM is doing the castle, look at the village number. But the village number is not huge difference anymore because he's raiding at home. And now we are getting the crazy game that we are getting in all the cities. He's sending all the villains and now he's going to try to micro. Look at the micro. He's going to kill the monk. Those monks are sick. But now he's going to make the castle. There you go, killing the monks. Well, 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 well. I want to see this game going. This game going 60% is going to kill the monks. He's killing the monks. No. And now he's killing the mine. Gonna... No. So many villains idle and reading here he can't. This is so hard game still. ACCM is trying everything, but it's over because he's losing now everything. Everything. Yes, the score is tricky. It's definitely so tricky because he's not able to do it. He should send the villains and try with villains. Kill the mangonels and, the, and that. Yes, this is what he should do. Otherwise, nothing to do. Nothing to do. He's not sending. He has now so magonized. He's now coming with those. Yes, it's impossible. Leary holds color now. Either thinks he's always around. But now he's sending the magonized. He's gonna send all the villagers. It's the only chance. Oh, he lost everything there. He lost everything. Oh, crazy. Crazy, but he's losing all. Yes, this is over. This is now over. He got a chance. He got a little chance, but but he got it. But now, without anything, he's trying to make the castle, but he can't. He's converting the monks, literally playing smart, really smart. But with that Dark Age, in the next round, in the semi-finals, Leary need to improve. In my opinion, if he's playing like today did, with many mistakes, I would say, he will have more problems. It, that's my opinion, you know? Because he's gonna face doubt or hard. And... Uh, that's, in my opinion as well, 
is another level. Now he did the castle, but 46 will is 78. The difference is starting to be huge, really huge. One, two castles, really close and defending, okay. Look at those amount of Magundais. Okay, it's going around with so many Magundais. Three villages on goal, and Leary is on the way to Imperial. On the way to Imperial, when he is, when he is calling. It's impossible I'm Funito that Leary win 3-0 to doubt, because he's a best of 7, so 3-0 is not gonna happen. At least, should be 4-0, but 3-0, impossible. Anyway, 6196 population, and with this difference, and going to Imperial is gonna be, well, game over. Because this civilization is, you have to get the advantage, if you are also defending, it's, it's impossible. It's really impossible. Okay, well, 30 population difference, halfway to Imperial Leary, and now, nah, it's, it's over. He will call the GG. He will call the GG. Yeah, but, but, but the score difference is, is unbelievable that he's still ahead. Why? Because he killed a lot of units more. Thanks to the castles. He killed and he's, he won't resign because he's well defended. I mean, since Leary doesn't have a castle, maybe he, he will try to raid. He has now a good amount of Mago dice, but he needs to raid. If he's not raiding, what he can do? You can see how the, the, the score is switching. Still, Leary didn't explore anything, or almost. That's plus two. He doesn't have ballistic. Taking the goal. And now what? Well. Those Maguda is really strong, gonna, gonna kill the monks, one monk down, two monk down, three monk downs, but now he needs to go away, yeah, well, he's doing a good micro, but look at the difference with the economy, that's huge, that's really, really huge, that's crazy, well, let's see what ACCM can do, he's still doing more and more Maguda is, doing the Lithium Warrior, this is completely open, he should try to wall, if he's not walling, how, how he can defend, how he can defend, because the raiding gonna happen, it's gonna be a huge raiding, ACCM now doing the bloodlines, but uh, Magoda is, yeah, they need a lot of upgrades, well, he's killing Billy's still, but, uh, yeah, but, but you can see, those eagles will, will dominate now, will dominate, man, will dominate, Okay, let's see those Mago dice. A lot of Mago dice. Well, he just needs to make Siege. And, well, Husbandry. He's doing all the upgrades. He has a lot of Mago dice, actually. But he needs to expand his economy. At home, he has still 2 tone center ACCM. Yeah, 2 TCs only. Now, University. But how to, how to stop those? But Leary, don't waste so many. Yeah, man. Don't waste so many. The problem is that it is still increasing his economy more and more. Leary is now mining a stone. Imagine if he has a castle. He's mass Magundice yet. But how many Magundice he need to mass? Poof. Need to, he need to, to mass so many Magundice, man. Well, gold sat mining, iron casting. He's going back or not? Now he's killing now all those. He need a TC there. Without TC, how to defend even? The castle is there. Oh, he's gonna kill that. Oh, good shot. But those Magundas are now strong. Remember that he has all the upgrades. Yeah, he's doing now the ballistic, the last that he's uh, missing. Well, he, he's missing the thumb brain too. Well, I think it's over. But uh, I don't know what ACCN can do. Maybe he, he can kill a lot of villages there. It's the only chance, but why he's not walling? I don't understand why he's not avoiding the, the... Yeah, look at those walls, yes, those walls are good, but this is what you need in, in all the other part of the map. Because here, he's taking good amount of eagles, and now he's gonna kill good amount of villagers, well, I don't know if he's gonna take good amount of eagles. Yeah, those eagles are really strong. We'll take all those Magodais, yes! 
he repairing that or not? Okay. Now he's going back to the tea, to the castle. Uh, he's, and he's doing a castle at home. He's playing now completely safe because he don't see a huge difference with the score. So he's trying to play just safe instead of going forward with the castle. He just wait at home and he's fine, completely fine. And he's raiding also here. And he's not resigning because he knows this is the is the last game. But uh, 117 villages. 69 villages. It's, it's completely over. It's completely over. And we will have... We will have... I don't know why he's not walling. We will have Leary in the semi-final. Yes. The first seed in the tournament is already there. He's in the semi-final. And uh, we will have the first semi-final the next weekend, remember, and we'll face doubt or heart. We will find his opponent later on, after the Viper and Winchester, that will be in one hour, guys. Yes, in one hour will be the Viper and Winchester. ACCM resources? No, he doesn't have good resources yet yeah, still 90 population only but if you still believe that he has a chance to come back it's because you really want to see a fit game which is nice it's very nice yes okay oh well look at those Yeah, he's still trying. He only need a trap. Well, the trap which it is there. With the trap which it, this is just game. This is just game. He's trying to kill the eagles. And look how how many shot, how many hits he need. He's now doing another house. And uh, still trying to raid. Well, he's still trying to do something. He see that the score is not huge, and he just want to try his last chance to survive in the tournament. He got so high expectatives and he wanted to be in the semi-final. For that he's playing, guys. We see everything. He might believe that he still have some advantage. He's repairing now. Look at the resources. He's about to go up. He's now killing the trap and he's gonna take it. There you go. So he's trying, man. He's putting a big fight there, trying to kill. Now he needs to go back. And at least the castle's still alive. But now he's raiding even more and more. All right. Taking everything there, and he's still not walling, which I don't understand. Now he's walling the stone, but he never walled here on the right side. And the goal, he takes this that tone center, he's losing the eagles, hand card, and now more eagles incoming and more trebuchet. Well, Leary doesn't have the greatest resources. You can see he's at the limit. He's using everything, and he has a lot of army. So he's coming with the second trebuchet and the eagles. But guys. The match of the day, well, all our match of the of the day today, but very soon the Viper versus Winchester in like 50 minutes. Something like this, guys. Something like this, which is gonna be good. It's it's gonna be good because I will have time to take a sandwich. Otherwise, I couldn't take anything. Huh. But don't worry, we are not going to stop streaming. We are going to keep here live. Okay. Scale Barden Armor. Well, Winchester has been practicing, and Winchester is a very strong player, man. I'm hyper for both games. Equally the same. Okay, he's coming with the three trebuchet, and now when he's killing this castle, that's it. He will call it probably. He's almost double the villages. But Gallant Wars as well. Look at those. Okay. Oh wow. Well, it's total domination now. It's really total domination. There you go. 
There you go. All right. Well, very strong. Very, very strong play here. Leary, confirmation. He lost the first game, but then all the other three games, he played so solid, so solid. And being the favorite, he took the game, took the game, and 3-1 in those cities, guys. He advanced for the semi-final. All right. Let's check everything. Leary paying the bettings. Military, you can see. Well, ACCM kill even more units. But a lot more army and the economy is huge difference. Look at this. Double, except stone, in everything. Food, wood almost double. More than double in gold. More than double. Vili is 151. Technology, you can see. ACCM got the 94 explorer map. Like in Feudal Age and 35 minutes in Imperial, the other one wasn't. Guys, this is the 3-1. Congratulations to Leary from Austria. Yes, he is in the semi-finals. Let's go back. Let's bring Leary here. Okay, with Leary, we are in the house. Congratulations, Leary. How are you doing? Thank you. Uh, I'm doing good. Even more, good. even more now, right? That you are already yeah. in the semi-final. I mean, uh, how yeah, do you, what, what is happening with, with those first games? You are, are starting the series like a bit slow or, or, or not? <laughs> yeah, I just woke up uh, at like 20 minutes before the first game. Then I eat fast. Then I was like still tired. But he played very well and I knew he was going for the... I kind of expected him to go for the strongest sieves to make me panic a little bit. So in this case, it was Mayans and then Magyars. He probably wanted uh, to zero and then reach the panic, so that he wins with the weaker saves as well against me, and uh, yeah, it didn't work. Have you seen the the draft for this matchup? I mean, you only got to one of the expansion civilizations, Burmese. All the others, that you were playing AOC, all the style, man. Aztecs, Hans, Britons, and Celts. <laughs> yeah, we banned actually only new saves, if I look at it. The strongest one, right? Most of them. Yeah. Indians, Berbers, Incans, Malians, but uh, after those bands that probably you thought that it was going to happen, um, were you happy with the draft there? Mm, yeah, I was happy because I knew uh, Mayans was the strongest Sith uh, in this whole draft. So I was kind of expecting him to win one game there because he knows how to play Mesa Sith very well. But then again, he has Mongols, Malay, and Ethiopians, which are three archer Siths. And I have Hans, Celts, Aztecs, and also Burmese with three Knight Sifts and Skirmisher Sifts, so I knew I had an advantage overall in the draft. You, you didn't think in going for for Arabize because you didn't even pick my stone with the with Burmese. No, I, in that game I knew like, I guess Belay you only need Skirms and Knights. They can't do Knights because they don't have plus two armor. I mean they can, but exactly. they're not that so. good. And if he does elephants, I will just go a few monks and it basically. Yeah, and it's easier to push, right? Because with uh, with uh, Arambais, yeah. uh, they are really strong, but you need to mine a lot of stone, you have to make the castle, you need to gather the units, and since you were with the advantage there, why to why to not go aggressive like, like you did? Well, yeah. what do you expect for now, or who you want? Because can be can be nice. One can be your friend, <laughs> heart, or or doubt. Heart is not listening. Who do you prefer now? To, to face <laughs> in the <laughs> semi-final. Honestly, I don't really care too much. I both know these two very well. I know their play styles. I know how strong they can be. I know how they can, how they can surprise other people. Um, but I know for a fact that Tao doesn't play too much lately and hard practices now a lot since he has holidays. So, yeah, yeah, the, we'll see, we'll see. But the practice, uh, the practice, um... You have seen people practicing a lot and it's out of the tournament and people not practicing or yeah. not playing too much and they are there. So yeah, but Hart also practiced the uh, draftings. He knows what to do in every situation basically. We practiced so many games together. Okay. We talked about everything. Okay, much. he has been studying a lot. So the series today against Doubt gonna be sick. Yeah, indeed. Come on, I need to hide the people. Gonna be sick. Come on, here. We, let, we try again. It's gonna be the same doubt versus hurt. Sick. Sick. Okay, oh, yeah. okay. Now, 
still not a hundred percent, Liri, but we will work on, uh, on the hype uh, in the future, okay? <laughs> all right, all right. Okay, well, um, uh, it's nice, man. You are the number one seed. Did you feel the pressure when when you lose those game? I mean, how you are feeling playing? Are you feeling nervous? Uh, well, before the first game, before the the tourney round starts, I'm usually nervous, but after the first game, it's all good. Like I'm not feeling any pressure anymore. I just play my own game and yeah. Yeah, I, I think, I mean, well, now it's, it's easier for me to say and it's like, oh, advantage. But I feel that, that you were more or less like this, that that the, that the first game, uh, it was like, mm, it's not a, like that a smooth play that you, when you play at your best, but then you like calm down a little bit more, no? And yeah, you were just doing your, your own thing, not, not thinking too much in what the other guy is doing, right? Yeah, exactly. Well, what did you think, uh, the last question, about that Mongol civilization, because after watching the the, the 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 Mongols speak, I don't see that uh, they, they, they are stronger and they're strong anymore, right? It's like with all those civilizations around, mm. that you have to. It depends about too early. a lot of things. Mm. Well, if you have a wall map, you can just go super fast scouts and then just wall up and go castlage. But I wouldn't say they are they're top fifteen Sith. Okay. Like uh, like the Dreads, for example. Now I think they're better Sith. Okay. Uh, one of the last questions. What you were trying to do in the last game with that Valier forward and you lost it, man? The stone? <laughs> yeah, I was affected into Tower Rush. I thought that was the only, it's the only way Mongols can beat Aztecs and I had my both stones forward, so... Also, I want to lane with Deers since I laned him. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, that didn't go well. <laughs> yeah, and you lost. One boar, two ships, yeah. and you have to probably change your, 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 your strategy on, on that game, but it worked well because he got a really terrible Dark Age. Uh, same here. <laughs> you, no, I mean, both were like, oh my god, that Dark Age, because you expect with the Mongol goes so fast, but he went up 24, 25 billion. So that gave you a huge advantage, no? Yeah, I knew that uh, he would probably go just wall, maybe go scout or just FC as well. Because I saw STC and he didn't have any sheep under it, so there were still two sheep running around the map and I also lamed one. So it was minus three sheep, and he also lamed, so he had to micro a lot of stuff at the same time, and yeah, that's why I was sure he was going wall. Okay. So for, I just went to see. For remaining games uh, today, the Viper Vinces, so who's gonna win? I think Viper. Okay. Any score? Mm, three one for Viper. Okay. Doubt Heart. That's the that's the complicator for you. Oh. <laughs> Who is gonna win and the score? Um, well, it depends on what they doubt has. I think uh, Hard will win 3 2. Whoa! Okay. Guys, did you listen? 3 1 Viper Winchester. 3 2 Hard versus Doubt. Now the fans from Doubt, Lily, will will gonna kill you, man. <laughs> we're gonna kill you. Uh, Lily, I know, I know. Thank you so much for coming and uh, keep no enjoying problem. the tournament. We will talk, okay? Thank you, thank, thank you. you. Thank yeah, you, all right. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Okay, I closed it, Team Speak. I'm sorry, I cut it his voice a little bit, but he, he left already Team Speak. And this is Leary, that uh, is already in the semi-final, guys.